Okay, Group D, oh, Bayern Munich, Man City, CSK Moscow, and uh, PLZEN. I don't know how to pronounce those lads. Plitzen and Plitzen. <laughs> Plitzen. But you know what, Logie, the, the top two are, it's a good group for them because uh-huh. they are way, way much better than CSK Moscow and Plitzen. They'll be much better than both of them. So Bayern Munich and Manchester City should qualify. New manager in, he's got great squad of players, but Pellegrini knows European football really well with his exploits at Villarreal and as a manager at Real Madrid. You know, he's done, and Malaga, look at what he did with Malaga last mm-hmm. year, who were a very, very small club and should have taken them probably to the semi finals were robbed in, the, in the, the, the two goals that were disallowed. But uh, I think Manchester City and Bayern Munich are two of the sides that could be, certainly if they're kept apart, could certainly feature in the last eight. And Munich under a bit of pressure defending champions, you know, no, uh, Guardiola coming in there, yeah. you know what I mean? Uh, it's, I mean, it's, it's a great club to go to. They've got plenty of money. They've got great talent. They've made a couple of good signings. They've signed uh, uh, Thiago Alcantara from Bayern, from, uh, Barcelona and uh, he, he will certainly improve the squad in the middle of the park in terms of creativity but um, they're, they're always there they're about mm-hmm. you don't write the Germans off Bayern Munich will definitely again be in, in the last eight for me I couldn't believe that Thiago was sold by Barcelona I thought he was a quality player he was man. but they offered him 20 odd million so they took the money <laughs> 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 